remember this one. I said it is new. Well, it's not of, um, you know what I mean? Not of 2017, 2018. This is of 2021. And we shall begin. Now this year is the portal room of, it's a pretty lame looking portal room, I admit. But anyway, the portal room of something. So let's start from here. We can just see some lovely little castle gates. This here is Newcastle, but also the last kingdom. And my third castle of the world. So this castle took five months worth of building and it's all built in survival. You can see why it took five months. It's huge. Um, yeah, it's got multiple different estates. I've already got a video covering this. So we're just gonna flash through it of all the main parts, but got army's camp, a class B farm, my first ever custom tree. Voila. Then we've got miner's estate, farmer's estate, massive crop farm to support the whole community. And we've also got some mini books over here. But most importantly of this castle, well, other than the main castle, is this is built in three different parts, but this here, the first build of the castle, this arena here, the whole sand drops. But what I want to do is take you inside of this castle. Let's just break away in. This floor is irrelevant. What I want to show you is this floor, my final stairs room. Now look at this, this is stunning. And we've got a cool roof as well. And basically, these portals, which I'm not going to do now because Incredible teleports you to the nether, are all different floors and rooms of it. And I just think this looks sick, so yeah. We've also got multiple other things inside this castle, such as crop farms and all sorts, but that's not what this is about. We're about to see the next area of... Well, actually, there's one thing I could show you, which is pretty cool. Hold on. Hold on. I don't know which floor it's on. I think it's this floor. Voila. This is the size of the kingdom from above. And yeah, I, it took five months because I didn't just build it in survival, I also built it in creative. Like all main regions of the world, we have ice mines, but this one needs to somewhere very cool. My caves and cliffs area. Well, not really, just it's within the limit of caves and cliffs, but most importantly, we want to see what's here. It is one of the coolest biomes in Minecraft. It is a... This has taken a while. Mesa! And we've got right here, we've got a little, a nice little hut on here. Nice cozy, and we got a train station. And for a train station, do you know what you need? You need train tracks, but instead I've got ice boats and two massive bridges. This bridge here was built three months, maybe two months, I can't be fully sure, but in 2022, after this one. No, 20, two months before, this one's a lot better. And this is my Wild West. First of all, if we go this way, that is going to take us down through the mountain, leading us over to A, across this plains. Right over here, we have got a rebuild of a build of mine from Pocket Edition, which was King Rogers Castle. We're alongside a pretty cool sand village, which has got a zombie spawner in the village. That sounds a bit stupid if you ask me, but it's also quite fun. Then let's go back. And here we have it, the Wild West. I do apologize, it is pretty awful, and I do want to rebuild a better one. But um, yeah, 
hang people there because of how bad this was built. It was built at the same time as my castle as one we build a week. Some buildings like this are all right. Others are, well, questionable. This one's all right. This one's, it does look well messy, but I do like this angle of it, but it's bad. Yeah, I got a, li a little mini Wild West and yeah, it doesn't really go for much. Um, but through here, which I may do for myself, my West, if this does not end up being corrupted, I'll have another bridge going off from here, over this way, across this class looking valley. Nice little pond there. We've got another massive mountain climbing up. And yes, you see there's a marker there, but also, right by here, I had a little attempt at making a sort of Mexican style village. It's all right. But I abandoned this place because I didn't like it. But the reason I built it here was because I found something here. Which is under that. But um, yeah, we don't need to know what that is. But it's a um, very big mountain. Tower marker. I wonder what could be under there. I really wonder. Anyway, let's go to the next area. Now, a very important location. From the world spawn, just over this way. We have got... A modern house. This is my main operations area where I just keep my valuables. Well, I keep a fraction of my valuables, should we say, where we got my map room so we can like find random stuff. And um, yeah, Will spawns about, that's quite clearly Newcastle. Weird. So, alongside. Um, when Caves and Cliffs came out, well, me and my friends got a new region to our world in the jungle. Yeah, we basically found a very, very small deep dark biome. Deep dark one work for all the those out for some reason. But anyway, let's see what region I'm talking about. It's pretty guessable considering we're in the jungle. So, let's go through. And here we have it, the treehouse region. Oh, wait, what? Oh. I forget that this is not up to date. There was a tree house on top of that tree with a second bridge. That's quite disappointing. But anyway, here's the lovely little tree house here. We got a uh, Danzo's tree house, Stabby Coolface tree house, um, my dog poo tree house, then my little den in there. And if we go over this way, we've got a platform over there. But the platform's not what counts because he doesn't want to build his tree house. He's got a pretty part of the jungle with loads of the pink flowers creating a lot of sport. Because there's a lush cave directly under that little temple there, which is the portal temple. But, portal temple, that's pretty boring. It's just got a portal in it. What really matters is over this way. And I'll give you a clue why it really matters. Are you ready? Oh, stairs, my mortal enemy. If you do not get that reference, then I have much wrong with you because this is Poe! Kung Fu Panda's temple on top of the hill with a lot of stairs go up to it. Not really that many stairs, it's the movies, but you know, Kung Fu Panda's temple. And uh, yeah, then we've also got a little dojo area around here. Wait, what? Oh, yeah, this is an old safe. There was a dojo there and a nice path we're going around with azalea trees, but instead we've just got a sparring deck. Um, the courtroom, and just... So, this portal here was the jungle, with that there leading down to the Neverite Mine. And over this way, we have got the portal of none other than the Last Kingdom. I called the Last Kingdom earlier, and Newcastle, but I didn't tell you why. It is World Spawn, by the way. It's called the Last Kingdom because it is the last castle that I, I'm i ever going to build because it took way too long and I did rush a lot of it. But if we go over this way, we've got another small region. So this here is a very random but achievement hunting area. This is my most recent area where we managed to get the Caves and Cliffs achievement um, amongst the Villa Star Trader, which this tower here goes all the way to the top of the world. 
and we had to put a lot of rails down, which took a lot of gold and iron. Then we did have a lovely hut here where we had about 20 villagers in. This was the initial breeding grounds of the villagers. Hopefully by now you know where we are. I did say where this leads to earlier, but we're now traveling there. And this is a building, but the viewing point is down this way. Oh, so also, right there we have got a medieval style house, right there, and probably the coolest looking ship in parts of the Caribbean, we've got the Flying Dutchman. This is a random region of my world where in the updated save, there's actually another building there. And me and my friends have a couple very, very small scale houses in the, the dark woods. And yeah, that's about it for this year. But more importantly is that I went to the Woodland Mansion back in probably 2018, the same, probably maybe even 2017. And I always had this area marked as strip mine under the mansion leading to it. But um, I always wanted to do something on this mansion and it took me five, six years to do it. And voila, very quickly. So with the mansion, I always wanted to build my mansion from my original survival world from Xbox One edition. If you don't understand, this is Minecraft Bedrock. Whereas you've also got go Minecraft Xbox One edition. You can't really see it now, but before Bedrock existed, that's how console players played this. And yeah, I wanted to rebuild my mansion from there. And to say the least, it's a lot smaller than that mansion. The rain just ruins the mood, but you know. Let's get on to the next bit. Okay, so. In that world tour, you missed out on a key detail is that more of my maps are explored. Like, um, I try to fly, but I'm forgetting that this is the, like, proper copy. But yeah, a lot more of the maps being explored, and that's a very cool place. Um, yeah, more map exploration. But what I'm really doing here is because a new region emerged since the recording of that world tour. This is literally two months later. And let's go see that new region. Turn around every now and again, I get a little bit. Oh yeah, also this is here. Um, takes you to the top of that fortress. That wasn't in the world. For some reason, oh, the boat did travel through the net pool. Perhaps they post could them. That's, um, yeah, let's leave that there. So, let's see what Swamp's about. That went well. Okay, let's go double time. Voila! It is the swamp. This ugly building here, which looks a bit like a witch's house, is our pink sheet pen because it runs more naturally. Then we have got one of my friend's house. Another friend's house and I made a mistake with this house. My house is three blocks wide. I also forgot to mention we like our frogs around here. They give us nice Shrek Swamp. Yeah, I have priorities if I live in a swamp. Okay, now let's go on a journey to the region that was not shown in the video, which is a very important region. 